Um, last month I had uh, someone stole some money from me, and this month I just did all my calculations, and it looks like somebody stole about four hundred and forty-eight dollars and sixty-eight cents. And I just got my welfare money like on the first, so and I'm on welfare, so I don't know how people are getting robbed and they're only on welfare. Yeah, I'm not too sure. Do you know like what transaction it was that? I don't know. I just calculated all my expenses, what I spent, and I'm missing four hundred and forty-eight dollars. Okay, yeah, but do you know the transactions that like aren't? No, I only know the ones that I did. So then, yeah. So then, can you see which transactions? Were no, I can't. I only can see mine. So I'm getting confused. So then, how do you know there's? Because I, I just calculated all the things that I bought, and that's how. Okay, I can take a look into it. Uh, can you confirm your full address on file? Yeah, just a minute. Okay, and do you have any joint accounts? No, you know I don't. Account? Okay. All right. Um, like, I'm not too sure. So, like, do you think there's transaction I don't know but I'm missing money from my account I got a thousand bucks like two days ago I made some purchases and someone stole some money last last month someone stole some money you guys had to replace the money and give it back to me so I had two hundred dollars in the account I assume and like I had a thousand two hundred and now yeah like like four hundred dollars and forty eight is missing so I don't know what's wrong with your bank but like yeah my money is going missing I'm not for transaction, but I don't know what you're talking about here. You could just figure it out. You're the professional. You're working there. I'm just the one with money spending it. But I need more information so that I can. Look okay, into so if you want, I could tell you. I could tell you all the expenses that all the money I spent, and then you could take it from there. You could see I only have two hundred and eighty-five dollars in my account, and I'm missing some money. Okay. Like, I see a bunch of Visa debit purchases. Were those you? Well, I made some, and some were probably, like, um, someone spending it. The, the, the thief. Okay, so I could tell you the ones from eBay. Um, so let me go on my eBay and show you. I made two purchases on eBay. One was like a doll for $14 US and one was um, some hair product for like maybe around 200 something. Okay. It was actually, um, let me see if it's here, $221. Okay, one What is it? What's the name of the product? It doesn't show me. It just says... Okay, well, I just told you number. that, like, in Canadian, okay. the pro the purchase I made is $221 Canadian. There's a... It was U.S. And in U.S., it was $139 and $25 shipping. Is that what you're talking about? No, the ones I'm looking at are 
looking at, it actually looks like they're ripped her. Okay, so we don't need to talk about that then. That's what's in the bank account right now. Um, okay, so I'll just give you the ones that I bought and you can sort it out, okay? Because I, it seems I just did my calculations and I'm supposed to have like $448.68 in there and I'm waiting for a refund of $273.33 off of Amazon. So, I don't know, you can figure it out. Okay, uh, one moment. Do you mind if I place you on a break hold? Do what you have to do. Two four two and two zero. Okay. And the uh, first security purposes. What is your age today, please? I'm twenty nine. And your home branch is located where? City in the street, please. Uh, well, I opened it up in La Salle. On uh, what street? And I think Newman and Dollard. Okay. So to uh to place around your car kite. Shadigo, a Shadigo Kamek, a J6K, 5H6. Two plus Mario Kart Shadigo, yes. Alright, phone number 514 Yeah. Alright, so you're calling about the virtual visa debit card? Yeah, um, seems that someone's been stealing my money. Okay, what do you mean? Well, I didn't make much purchases. I got 1200 in my bank, um, like on the first, I made a purchase for fifteen ninety nine, thirty three, forty one, eighty five, sixty three, seventy two, forty seven. Say add like two hundred more. You better give me back my four hundred thirty eight dollars. Um, two hundred forty three, fifty one, twenty seven, twenty uh, two hundred twenty one, and forty six dollars. And yeah, like it all adds up to. I'm supposed to, I made a purchase for $273. I asked for a refund and I, some, there was an incorrect purchase. I got a refund for that. And yeah, now I only have like two something in my bank and I'm supposed to have like maybe 448 more or that included. No, no, 438 more. 
No. Don't tell um, me. 273. It hasn't been refunded yet. There's one for 221 as well. 46. 221 46. I was supposed to get that 273 too. Yeah. Including in my 400 dollars. Right, no. Okay, so what's your question? Uh, well, I'm missing money, you know. Okay, but all the transactions are all Amazon and eBay. Well, I don't know, but I'm missing money from my account. And I made my purchases. I didn't have much to buy this month, and my money's missing. Okay, well, you're going to need to go through all your transactions and, and see which ones are yours. I don't know where you're, if you're missing money or not. Well, I can't see them on my end. I could, I don't know what's going on on the bank end, but like I know what I bought. I could see it inside of my um account. Okay. I, well, okay. Okay. So let me just back up here. You're going to need to wait to see them that they're posted and to go through all of them and see if they don't belong. If it isn't there, then it happens. Well, I know what belongs to me. Like I have, I already went through it all. Okay. I already is did my calculating. That, is there anything that you see that does not belong to you? Well, I don't know. I'm not using the bank. I'm using my apps that like to find out what I bought. Okay, but I mean, man, how, do you, how am I supposed to know what is yours and what isn't? If you well, I could, give you, I could give you the prices of what I did buy. No, and no, then no, you no that's, not, that's not what we're going to do. You're going to tell me. And you're on record, so you can have some respect, okay? Because I'm already missing money and I'm in a stressful situation here. Because I'm on welfare. I don't need people stealing $400 from me. So I'm have some respect. You're on record. I'm going to you. Excuse me. Yeah, go ahead. Can you show a little respect? Okay, well, I'm don't be rude to me because I wasn't being rude to you. I'm not being rude to you. Yes, you I'm are. I'm trying to tell you which transactions do not belong to you. I'm t I could tell you what does belong to me because no, I, I'm no, not the one, not, like, no, stealing money from myself. I'm not the one stealing no. money from myself. Okay, I'm not saying that you're stealing money from yourself. Is there any transactions that you do not recognize? I could only see the ones that I did do, and I'm not on the the uh, I'm not on online banking. Okay, well then okay. you're gonna need to go through your transactions. I did. I already did. Like I said, I'm trying to tell you I did. Something that doesn't belong to you. That is what you tell me. Well, in my um in my purchase history, um there I don't see any like other purchases that I did not make. I only see the ones that I made. Okay, well then, there's no fraud. And I already so, called the bank. They said calculate all the things that I did buy, and that's what I did. All right, but I'm a fraud agent. So if you have any fraudulent transactions that you would like to report, I'd be happy to take them. But I need to know specifically which transactions do not belong to you. Okay, well, you have to figure that out. That's what you're supposed to do. That's your job. No, it isn't. You have to tell me what doesn't belong to you. Um, this happened last month, and that that's exactly what happened. So you could find like the correct person to do this because, I like I said, you guys made last month this happened again. I went through. You guys made me go through all the things that I did buy. I did it, and the same things happening again. So we're doing the same thing again. Okay. Well, if it happened last month, did you cancel your card? Yeah, and I got a new one, and this month I'm getting money stolen again, even more this time. Okay. Well, last month you filed claims for Amazon transactions. Okay, well, this month money is missing again. Okay, well, when you know which ones don't belong to you, please give us a call. Once they've, tra they've posted and you see exactly... I don't know because it's not on my thing. Like, I don't see what's not there. Wow, the bitch hung up. Yeah, hello. You you guys' service is very poor because like last month you guys have you guys stole money from me. This month you guys stole like four hundred dollars from my account, and I'm calling you to like give me back my money. And you guys are being very fucking rude to me and hanging up the phone on me when I'm having a I'm being victimized here. I can take a look what's going on, but we need to be calm first, okay? Okay. Well, don't be hanging up the phone on me and screaming at me on the phone. Like I, you guys stole I'm money from me. Okay, well, whatever. Connect me to the fraud line. Sorry? Connect me to the fraud line. Because I, I explained everything. I explained, I explained. No, I'm not, sh I'm not shouting. I explained everything to you. I explained everything to you guys. And then you connected me to another line. I had to wait on the phone for 40 minutes just to get screamed at by some fucking bitch. And then after she hung up the phone on me. She was yelling at me. Okay. I was trying to explain I to her all my that. transactions, and she's trying to tell me, give her the transactions I didn't do. How can I give you the transactions I didn't do if it's the same thing like last month? I cannot see them. 
Okay, I can get you to the security team, but just to let you know, it's a little longer wait there. So you might have to wait. Okay, well, go ahead and put it on then. Put it on. Keep it with me here then. Anyways, they hung up the phone.